Hello Aquarius, thanks for visiting. This is your reading for September the 9th through to the 15th. And if you like this reading, please like, subscribe and comment if that's what you'd like to do. I love and appreciate you also very much for all of your support on my channel. And for private readings specific to you, please visit katietarot.com. So Aquarius, let's take a look at what spirit, your angels and guides would like to bring through for the week ahead. For Aquarius, please. And please just be patient a moment while I draw the cards for you. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Aquarius. And remember it's general in nature, so please take what resonates for you and leave what doesn't. Aquarius, this is where you are currently, what's below you, what's behind you, what's above you and what is coming toward you. So let's take a look at your first message. We have renewal and it says review and evaluate a favorable assessment of the facts. Time to move in a new direction. Wow, this is so powerful, Aquarius. This week is about assessment of a change and once this change has come about once you've made the decision and you start to put into place actions and make this change come about then things are not going to be the same again it is like coming into a brand new day and so there's a wonderful fresh energy here and you're leaving the past behind and you're walking in a new direction a direction that is perfect for you and your highest path so i'm sensing an amazing energy here for you this week aquarius to tap into to be aware of because this energy is around you and i feel that this renewal this awakening this uh, decision making that's going to change things in a big way for you is going to produce such amazing results in your future so let's take a look at your next card. We have the native B and the keyword here is prosperity. And that is exactly the energy I was feeling uh, from this renewal energy, the end product here, what you're going to bring through um, and manifest is going to be prosperous for you. There is abundance here in what you are wanting to create. And it comes from this specific change that is around you at the moment, this awakening of what is truly going on, what you are, how you are truly feeling and what you really, uh, where you really want to go. You know, it's a very big uh, decision for some of you. Now for others, this can be smaller, a smaller, more day-to-day -day thing that you decide upon that you review, you analyze, and then you make a decision based on the facts. And even though it's smaller, it is going to compound though. So it's going to have an effect down the track anyway, and it's going to be prosperous and abundant for you. So this is an amazingly positive energy. Let's take a look at your romance card. We have make the effort and it says great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So in terms of romance, if you are in a new relationship or if you are in an established relationship, making the effort, reaching out to your loved one and showing them affection, listening to them, having a heart to heart discussion, making the effort to go and uh, spend time, energy, effort on them or with them, it's going to improve and uplift your relationship with them. Now, this is a very positive energy for both uh, for both uh, people that have been in a long-term relationship and also singles that are looking for love because if you are looking for a relationship then you are in the best energy this week to make an effort to find that person being more social um, if you are interested in someone you have someone in mind then making an effort, showing them that you're interested, this type of thing is there. So a beautiful energy here for romance. 
Let's take a look at this card. Transformation. I mean, what more can I say here, Aquarius? You are in the midst of a big change, a big transformation. Or like I said, it can come through as little things or little details that you're focusing on. You're making decisions about this and then it's going to have a long term ripple effect down the track for you to bring in an established prosperity. So very positive here. And this can be in love, romance and personal relationships or it may be in another area of your life, whatever these changes, wherever these, these changes are happening for you. It could be in the workplace or in the community, in your home life, whatever it is. But there's a transformation around you big time here, Aquarius. It says things are changing at a cellular level and there's deep healing as well. So that may be the case, deep healing, physical, mental, emotional, spiritual healing. You may be involved in this or this could be what the transformation is about. Also, Spirit is saying this is what some of the prosperity for some of you is about. It is about healing and, and um, being at a high vibrational level in that sense. So things are definitely changing. When, is, when it says at a cellular level, there's a sense here of smaller things, smaller things. So changes in small ways for some of you are going to bring long lasting effects. So let's take a look at where you are currently. Well, look at this, Aquarius. You are in the planning stages. So this is positive. You're looking at the world. You're seeing what you can do, produce, change, uh, what your next step is going to be. And you may have a partner standing alongside you, wanting to go down this path with you and journey with you on this journey, whether it's a relationship, romantic, or it could be a business partner or another person, but I am seeing another person involved here in your life or decision making process. You are excited, you know, you are thinking in a positive way about your choices this week and the and the end, um, the, the result of those decisions. And the two, of course, is about choices and decision making. Now below you, we have the Eight of Swords. Eight of Swords is interesting here below you because it can mean that in the past or the energy around you currently has been a bit restrictive. Communication may not have been flowing easily. There's a sense of being bound, restricted, not able to voice your truth or be heard or get through to someone. Um, the dynamics here are not healthy. I'm also seeing that emotionally you, you've been bound and kept at a certain level. You're wanting to expand and explore your emotions, but it's been difficult. Let's take a look at what is behind you here. We have the devil. Okay, so these two cards, the Eight of Swords and the devil, both indicate entrapment and of giving away your power to somebody or someone else or a situation or a circumstance in your life, Aquarius. Of course, the devil can be a Capricorn in your life. That may be the case for some of you. There is, in essence here, a sense of um, being held back um, or being oppressed in some way. So you're looking forward and planning to break free of this. And you can see, you can see or you will begin to see uh, the, the changes, the steps forward that you can make to uh, alleviate these restrictive energies. Let's take a look at what's above you. We have justice. So you're looking at this, even though emotions are involved here for some of you, you're looking at this in an objective way. With justice, the truth is going to come out. There's going to be a fair decision made. You're balancing, weighing up all, all of your options here. Um, or an outside source will be doing this. And so there's a sense of karma involved in this as well. Um, there may be, of course, legal issues, court cases, documents, official matters, and these types of things going on in your life this week. And justice is Libra as well. So there may be a Libra involved in your life. Now, this is wonderful coming in towards you, Aquarius, the page of wands. This is enthusiasm, a brand new start, a brand new mindset coming in. This can indicate younger people than you or children or youth or someone younger than you. There's a sense here of 
enthusiasm for what is to come. So even though, even though you have some difficult circumstances around you, some challenges to overcome, you're planning, you're looking to your future, you're being honest with yourself and with others, and you have a partnership here and you're excited about, about this brand new uh, change that is just about to come in energetically for you. Amazing energy, Aquarius. I hope you all have a wonderful week ahead and I will talk to you all again soon.